them, them want to blow my opportunity to now introduce uh, our congressman for the second congressional district, Congressman Chaka Fatale. <laughs> Isn't this a beautiful piece of work? Well, we have one that uh, is being presented um, to the President of the United States uh, by these workers here. They've been working and they, and they do great work, don't they? And to our Secretary of Commerce. Let me, uh, let me, let me welcome uh, all of you uh, here. I've been this way before. I visit uh, places in my district where people uh, work at, and I came this way, and I've always been impressed uh, by the people I've met and the leadership here. So I called Bill earlier this week, and I said, we're going to bring the Secretary of Commerce uh, over to Penn Fishing. Uh, and uh, I'm not sure he took it all in at once, but as we kind of work through the fact that the person in the president's cabinet responsible for our economy was going to come here because of the, the great efficiency and work and dedication of the co-workers, as Bill refers to all of the people he works with here, which I think is a wonderful terminology that tells you something about this great family of, uh, of people here at Pitt Fishing. So thank you for welcoming us. Now, the Secretary got in, we made our way up the expressway, there's a lot of traffic, we apologize for being late, but this is important business. Now we've had the GDP numbers today, and for the third straight quarter, we've seen improvements in our gross domestic product, and on average 3.9 over these three quarters. We've seen the first net increase in jobs in the country since this horrific uh, recession hit. We see increase orders in purchasing and durable goods, on and on and on. But the work that the Secretary is here to talk about today is this export initiative because the President has launched, and this is the first time in American history, a comprehensive initiative embodying um, all facets of our government. They actually have set up an export cabinet led by the Commerce Secretary to promote American goods in markets across the world. And these fishing reels sell all over the world. And you know, we have peanut chews that are made down the street. One of the, uh, the top uh, deputies to the secretary said, Tasty cake. You know, <laughs> we make peanut chews, we sell them in some 45 different languages around the world. And so we have some 1,300 manufacturers right here in the Philadelphia area. Uh, and we want to know that at the center of this plan, that Philadelphia is going to be a central role. And that's why the Secretary is here uh, to help launch this. I want to uh, thank uh, my colleague for joining me, Congresswoman Allison Swartz, who uh, represents parts of Philadelphia and parts of Montgomery County. Give her a round of applause. She's a great Congresswoman. She is a great Congresswoman, and she's doing a great job. So the Secretary is here. He was formerly the governor of the state of Washington. He led an effort there uh, to uh, export products from his state. It in they increased by $5 billion uh, in terms of marketing their products uh, in China and other places around the world. I know he's leaving for another overseas trip. He travels a lot because he is a salesperson for our country and for our businesses. And, for our workers. They are increased wages in manufacturing. They increased wages some 15% higher in jobs connected to exports. So this administration says they want to double those jobs. And uh, I'm on the Appropriations Committee. Uh, Senator Casey sent in a letter. Um, I already got the message. We're going to make sure that we fund this export initiative. And Senator Casey's been at the very forefront in the Senate of uh, pushing this. Uh, because all across our state, whether we're talking to Hershey, um, Hershey candies, I mean, we got a lot of sweet products in uh, Pennsylvania. <laughs> That's why the dentists do so well in our state. But the point here is that uh, this initiative is critical in the symbolism of the Secretary of Commerce and the substance of him being here 
I want to thank the governor for his great work in this arena and the mayor who's doing a terrific job in our city. I want you to welcome the Secretary of Commerce, member of the President's Cabinet, a great friend of Philadelphia, and a great friend of American workers, Gary Locke.